ask Mandy Cohen, who was in our booth, later became a producer, for every day you have root beer. Every day she said, Harry, we don't have root beer. Finally, I told Mandy, give him diet Pepsi or Coke, whatever you have up there, because he's got no taste buds. They've been long dead with all of the alcohol he's consumed. So she would go up and get him a, a diet, whatever. <clears throat> well, this one day, uh, and Harry, by the way, never went to the bathroom, ever. When the game started till the game ended, it could be five hours, it could be 15, 18 innings, it didn't matter. He never went to the bathroom. He must have had a bladder like a camel. I have no idea how he did it. He told me, well, I practice. I don't know how he practiced, but okay. So anyway, Mandy, hey, Mandy, can I get some root beer? Yes, so she leaves the booth. I'm writing up my lineup, and I hear this blood-curdling scream, and Harry is standing next to me, jumping up and down, because he has gotten his little appendage stuck in his zipper. He apparently had he apparently had left it down when he left the washroom, and now when he went to zip it up, he got stuck. A problem that a lot of us folks have experienced in our lives, but doesn't make it any less uncomfortable for him and any less funny for me. He was bouncing up and down, screaming, going, whoa! I said, Harry, you got to sit down. People can see you on both sides of the booth. He goes, no, I'm stuck. I said, oh, I know you are. But he says, well, I can't. I, I can't get it out. I said, Harry, you got to do something. And he's, I'm telling you, he's beet red. The sweat is pouring down his face. And I look over to him. Finally, I look up there, and there's Mandy coming in the booth. I said, you better yank that little sucker out of there because Mandy's coming back in the booth. So I hear this, Eah! he sits down, crosses his legs, must have been bleeding for three innings. It was one of the funniest things I'd ever seen. My head was down on my score pad. I was just, the tears were streaming down my face. It was literally the single funniest moment I ever had with Harry in the booth.